Oh, my dear Hiranya Kashipu, do not feel like this. We know that just by the movements of your eyebrows, all the commanders of the various planets are afraid. Simply by yourself, you have conquered the whole universe. Therefore, we see no reason for you to be full of anxiety. This Prahlad is only a boy. Let us take him back to our school and we shall purify his intelligence. Why, take him. Take him. Leave my sight now. Oh, oh, I'll leave my sight. shall learn what is the goal of life. And the goal of life is to please Hiranya Kashipu. <laughs> yes, yes. So, does anyone know what Hiranya means? Oh. Gold. Excellent, excellent. Gold. You want gold. And the more gold you have, the happier you'll be. And what does Kashipu mean? Very good. Now, we shall learn what is the goal of life again. We sh what? To get lots of gold. Yes, yes. And? Sleep in soft beds. And? And to attract the most beautiful women. Yes. Very good. Very, very good. good, children. Very good. Now? Mm. Now it's time for lunch. So let's go and enjoy. Yes. And while we're gone, Prahlad shall be the monitor. You do what he says, and we shall be back very soon. Let us eat. Let us eat. Dear atheistic friend, <laughs> the real goal of life is to stop the repetition of birth and death. And now is the time, now that we have this rare human body, which is so temporary. Just look, how long can you live? A hundred years at most. And for a person with uncontrolled senses, almost half of the time is wasted in sleep. Then. The first 20 years goes to playing ball. The middle 40 years is wasted in family life. You get a wife, you have kids. To support your family, you have to get a job. For your work, you want some recognition. You spend all your time like a madman. And before you know it, you're in a feeble condition. And so the rest of your life is spent as an invalid. Guru Shushu Shea Bhakta. Sarva Labdharpane Nacha Sangye Na Sadhu Bhaktanam Ishwara Radhane Nacha But first you must take the shelter of a pure Guru, Sri Guru, and then under his guidance. It is so easy. If you just chant the names of Hari, easily you can become freed from this material entanglement. Chat with me. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. 
most unintelligent disruptor of our family. You are the lowest amongst mankind. You violated my powers to rule you. And therefore, you are an obstinate fool. Today, I shall send you to the abode of Yamaraj. You rascal, you know that when I am angry, all the planets in the three worlds tremble along with their chief rulers. And by whose power has a wretch like you become fearless and overstep my powers to rule you? Where do you get your powers from, Berlan? From the same place you do, Father. From God. God. God? What is this God? Prahlad, you rascal. You are trying to minimize my value as if you were better than me at controlling the senses. This is over intelligence. I can therefore see that you want to die by my hands because only this kind of nonsensical talk is indulged by those about to die. Prahlad, you are the most fallen of our family. But you have always described a supreme being who is better than me, who is above everything, who is the controller of everyone, and who is all pervading. But where is he, Prahlad? Where is he? He is everywhere, Father. He is in everything. Everywhere? In everything? If he is everywhere, then why is he not present before me now in this pillar? Huh? He is, Father. 
then let him save you as I sever your head from your body. Yes, let's see your God come and try to save you now! Shring Dave is extremely furious at all of us. Please, go forward and try to appease the Lord. condition in this material world. When will that time come when you will take me to the shelter of your lotus feet? My dear Prahlad, most gentle one, all good fortune unto you. I am very much pleased with you. It is my pastime to fulfill the desires of all living beings, and therefore you may ask me any benediction you desire. 
My dear Poulon, may you live a long time and accept all benedictions for material happiness. My dear Lord, kindly do not tempt me with these illusions. If a person desires some material gain in exchange for devotional service, he can never become your pure devotee. If you really want to grant me a benediction, that I pray that you take the material desires from the core of my heart and that you excuse my sinful father. Oh, gentle one, may all of your desires for my service be granted. Your father, Hiranya Kasipu, is my great devotee and is already liberated. In fact, 21 generations of your family, both before and after you, have already been liberated. very happy. I told Sridham and Mahibhara, I want to that you should play the drama of Nishingha Dev and Prahlad Maharaj. Today, very excellent. I am very, very much happy and satisfied. Accident. Hmm? Excellent. Yeah? Excellent. 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 Part of Hirnakashipu. <laughs> <laughs> and not less than him, oh, my dear Prahlad Maharaj. <laughs> you know, that Hirnakaspu is the son of Mahibharata. <laughs> and also the daughter Prahlad Maharaj is daughter of oh, Mahibharata Prabhu. <laughs> and oh, listen the best oh, son in law of Mahibharata. <laughs> very, very. Best role for Nishinkhadi. <laughs> but I am very much satisfied by the role of Prahlad. Very frankly and very well speaking the Bhagavat sloks and explaining. And then Kayadhu, North Rishi. Oh, Sanda, Marka, oh, very good, both, eh? Rukmanhar and Mahibhara, very good role. And the Narad Rishi also played very good role. And also four Kuvars. And the part of Jai and Vijay in the book, in the beginning, very good. And all the children singing with Prahlad Maharaj in Gurukul. Oh, very good, very good. And all two gods are three gods. Oh, very good, very good. Excellent. Who are gods? Hmm. Who are gods? You and they. So, 
So I think. Who? Gaur Nithai. What they are? Gaur Nithai. Gaur Darfa. That's their name. Gaur. Oh. My heartly blessings to them. I told them to place the drama to see the character of Prahlad Maharaj. I want that we should all follow the good character of Prahlad Maharaj. Even he was given poison. He was thrown from the mountain in ocean. Very wild oil. Wild uh, oil and on the snakes, mad elephants, but he was saved by, oh God. So I want that this, but even Prahlad Maharaj never accused his father. No harsh word for, for him. Always, dear father, dear father. So, we respect our father and mother. Whatever they may be. If they are like demons, you should not hear his katha. But never for insult him in this way. Or Prabhupada Bhakti Siddhan Saraswati Goswami. He read this Srimad Bhagavat and gave class on these hundred eight times. So we can learn so many things from this drama play. Gaur Premanamade. <laughs> Thank you.